What's good, y'all? Hey, Zo, back with another video, man. Hope y'all doing well out there. Hope y'all enjoying y'all day, man. I got a quick video for y'all today, man, about manifestation, man. Anything you want to manifest, I got a few tips for you, man. So let's just get right into it. First thing I want you to understand, anything you want to manifest, anything you desire, the only reason you want it is because of the way you think it will make you feel once you have it in your experience. Anything you desire, anything you want to manifest into your life, the only reason you want it is because of the way you think it will make you feel once you have it. All right, so why is that so important to understand? It's because you can feel those emotions right now. You can feel those emotions and how you will feel if your manifestation showed up right now. You can feel it right now. You can feel and isolate those emotions and feel those emotions right now. And the law of attraction is always working. It's always in full effect. It's always in full effect, whether you know it or not, whether you want to use it for your benefit or not, it's always in full effect. Just like the law of gravity is always in full effect. You don't have to wake up in the morning and think like, is the gravity working today? No, nah, you don't think like that because it's always in full effect. The law of attraction is always in full effect. Whenever you're thinking, the law of attraction is working. All right? it's, in, it's in motion. All right? So keep that in mind, man. So if you can feel those emotions of the emotions you will feel once your manifestation shows up, if you can isolate those emotions, take time out your day to feel those emotions, become clear on what those emotions are, then your manifestation is well on its way. It's well on its way, all right? You can write down your emotions that you will feel just like you write down your goals. You can write down the emotions you will feel once you accomplish those goals. Write down the emotions as well so you know exactly what you're striving for, what you're reaching for on a daily basis, all right? So take time out for yourself. Like I said in one of my videos, take time out for yourself to feel those emotions. Take time out for yourself because when you take time out for yourself and do what you enjoy doing, you're sending off good energy. You're sending off positive, you know, good vibrations, good energy. And you're feeling the emotions of what it feels like to feel good. Whatever it is you're trying to manifest, whether it be money, a relationship, whatever it is, more than likely one of the emotions is going to make you happy, excited, those type of emotions. If you can feel those emotions, you're going to attract more things into your life that make you feel those same, the same way. All right? So not only will you attract your manifestation, but you will enjoy the journey the whole way there. You will enjoy the journey the whole way there because you will be attracting, attracting things that make you feel the same exact way. So become, become clear on the emotions you want to feel that you will feel when your manifestation shows up and try to feel those emotions as often as you can. As often as you can, as frequent as you can. This is why people say, speak it into existence. People say, speak it into existence because when you speak it into existence, you're already feeling the emotions of how it feels if it's already in your experience. You're already feeling exactly how you would feel if that manifestation showed up right now so speaking into existence always helps but the main point of that is feeling the emotions of how it feels and understanding and feeling those emotions as often as you can all right so when you say it out into the world send it out to the universe you're feeling those emotions and the universe will respond with exactly what you're putting out all right so this is also why people say proper preparation proper preparation preparation <laughs> proper preparation prevents poor performance because when you're preparing yourself you're practicing over and over and over again you're already putting yourself in that situation you're already feeling exactly how it feels for that manifestation or that experience to be right here right now so speaking into existence feel those emotions of how it will feel to have that manifestation in your experience right now all right so go about your life go about your day trying to feel those emotions isolate those emotions fill out Feel out what are those emotions, man. And try to feel those emotions as often as you can. All right? So a good example of speaking into existence. About six months ago. About six months ago, I started listening to affirmations, right? Abundance affirmations. So one of the affirmations they were saying, and I was repeating over and over again, was I receive money in expected and unexpected ways. I receive money in expected and unexpected ways. So you know what happened? About two, three weeks after I started listening to that, I I, uh, I received a random check in the mail from one of my old jobs. I received a random check in the mail from one of my old jobs that I don't even work at no more. I received unexpected money. You feel me? So me speaking it out into the universe, I received money in expected and unexpected ways. I received an unexpected check in the mail. All right? That's just a quick example. Another example. I uh, told my sister this. When I was listening to the affirmation, I received money in unexpected ways. I found a random dollar on the ground. 
I was never finding money on the ground before I started listening to that affirmation over and over again. So I found a random, unexpected dollar on the ground. So speaking it into existence definitely works. So try to feel, but more importantly, then speaking it into existence is feeling the emotions. Do what you got to do to feel those emotions of how, of how it would feel if your manifestation showed up right now. And also, a very important thing about this is believing that it will show up. Believing that you have perfect timing. Believe that it will show up at the right time. Believe that God, the universe, whatever you want to call the source that created all this. I know people got different names for it, the most high, all these things. But believe that he will deliver it to you at the perfect timing. It's already for you. You got to believe what's for you is for you. And it will show up at the perfect timing. You can't be contradicting yourself. You can't be saying, I want abundance. I want money. I want a relationship. But at the same time thinking, it'll never happen for me. I'm not worthy of it. You know, you got to believe it's worthy. You're worthy of it. You got to believe you're deserving of it. You got to believe it's already for you. It's already done. It's already done. You just got to line up with it. You got to feel exactly how it feels to be in that situation. And it will show up in your life. And not only will it show up in your life, but you're going to enjoy the journey the whole way there. Yeah, I know I say that a lot on my channel. Enjoy the journey. Don't forget to enjoy this life. Enjoy the journey, man. You got to enjoy the journey, all right? So also you can give thanks in advance. Give thanks in advance. Say thank you for my manifestation showing up. Thank you for my relationship showing up. Thank you for my wealth showing up. Thank you for the wealth I have now. This is putting yourself in the exact feeling and emotion and experience of you already having your manifestation. You gotta put yourself already like it's already done. Like it's already being delivered to you. It's already done. You gotta believe it's already done, all right? So of course you gotta take action on the way, but on the way you gotta believe it's still, it's done, it's done. You gotta, more importantly, most important thing is believe it's done, it's for you, and it's on its way, all right? It's done. It's already done. Believe it's already done, all right? So next thing I want to say is visualizing. Visualizing is important, too. It's not necessary. You don't have to do it, but it always helps, you feel me? It always helps you eliminate the feeling of your manifestation being absent. Absent. It helps you eliminate the feeling of lacking it. You got to feel like it's already done. Feel like it's already in your experience, all right? One example of this, visualizing. Last year, 2019, at the beginning of the year, I had a desire to ride jet skis across uh, South Beach. I had a desire to do that. So every, not every day, but very often, I would listen to, not listen to, but visualize how it would feel riding across South Beach. You know, the clear water, just zooming across the water, doing donuts. I just, I visualized that very often. So I manifested it in 2019 summer. And while I was out there, I just felt great. You, you feel me? I felt great. I felt bliss. I felt double excitement because I already felt it. I already experienced it in my mind. I imagined it in my mind over and over again. So once it came into my life, I just felt like I manifested it because I did. I manifested it. I seen it over and over again. I felt it in my mind. I felt the emotions. I visualized it over and over again, exactly how it would feel. And then it showed up in my life. So I enjoyed that experience. I enjoyed that, you know, manifestation experience. But Visualizing is always helpful. You feel me? It helps you eliminate the feeling of absence and lack. You feel me? You gotta, you gotta get rid of this resistance that you don't deserve it. That you, that's not gonna happen for you. You gotta believe it's gonna happen. And it's gonna happen for you, and believe that God is gonna deliver it for you at the right time, at the perfect time. You gotta believe it's gonna show up at the right time. You have perfect timing. Everything is right on time. All right. So, yeah, man. Hope y'all got something from this video, man. Uh, I wanna say. Thank you to all my supporters. Thank y'all for watching. Subscribe if you're new to my channel. Follow me on the gram. I got more videos on the way, man. Peace.